early month of Ramadan, you can actually lose weight. Like any weight loss program, a fasting period can really help you if you understand the human body. So the important perspectives to losing weight are actually the input and the output. Now obviously during the fasting period your output or your workout or exercises are not going to be there and therefore you will be exercising during the period where you are eating and replenishing your reserves. So the strategy with our Muslim clients is can we give them the right meals when they are about to start the fast. So my recommendation is casein which is a milk protein which has a sustained release of 5 hours, L-carnitine which is a fat burner. Body Fuels has a brilliant product in L-carnitine. It's an appetite suppressant. It will enable greater burning of fat through the whole day and release more amount of energy from fats to help you have a more productive day. Astaxanthin, which is a very potent blue-green algae antioxidant, which will help preserve or prevent your muscles from going into extreme catabolism. So if you put all of these together, in your pre-meal before you start your fast you will have an added advantage using sports nutrition secondly when you go to break your fast i would recommend a whey protein with some dates as breaking your fast a lot of choices of people that i see the muslim brethren in my neighborhood when you go past mosque road there's a lot of oily foods there's a lot of luscious smells and oils and everything now you are in a fast for close to 12 hours and during this period your body has shut down and said hey I am in total state of fast it's a famine condition so the next meal you feed me I don't know when you're going to give me the next meal so let me tell you something as your body I am going to store all the food you give me as fat now if you take the improper ingredient that is carbohydrate and fat in higher ratio you're going to immediately fuel greater fat deposition so number one you're losing muscle through the day number two you're enhancing the fat deposition uh, through uh, the feeding period so it is very important that when you break your fast you use a whey protein and you have some dates and then get into a more advanced meal so what happens when you fast during the holy period of ramadan now the human body requires carbohydrate as an energy source that is the glucose that you give via the foods you eat protein is required to preserve the muscle fat is when you have starvation mode or famine conditions the body utilizes its fat reserves now during fasting what's going to be happening is your sugar levels will drop completely so a lot of you will face headaches will face lightheadedness will face uh, low BP at the end of the day then the body after three to four days shifts into what we know as the ketogenic phase or the utilization of fats for the release of energy so with the ketogenic phase you are going to be sluggish it is a requirement for holy fasting what we can do with nutrition is help you design your meal when you are going into a fast so the last meal before you go into the fast and when breaking the fast what type of meal you should be taking when this is done correctly you can optimize the fat burning period of the holy month of Ramadan which means you can actually lose weight wherein a lot of our clients who come to us actually gain weight and the secret is understanding the ketogenic phase and how can you eat during the lower part of the day where your metabolism is lower that is during post sunset your body's metabolism drops so how many calories do you need to be putting how much of protein how much of carb how much of fat so fasting has been around for centuries and in most of the religions the whole idea is to cleanse the human body now one very important parameter in today's day and world is abundance and gluttony the problem with food is we don't consider food to be a sin and so the periods of fasting when you get into the periods of feeding you have to understand from a dietetics or a nutrition point of view you cannot feed your body more calories than it really requires the requirement let's say for 2000 calories in a normal working man and a fasting working man remains 2000 calories so the whole idea is how can you deliver 2000 calories continued in your post fasting state and this 2000 calories has the correct amount of protein 
correct amount of carbohydrate, correct amount of fat, split into that three or four meals from sunset to sunrise. Please note one thing, your body at this time in the circadian rhythm, that is the biological clock, is at its lowest metabolism. So you may not be even needing 2000 calories, you may be needing lesser than that. And a lot of times my question to my Muslim brethren out there is, are you planning a customized nutrition plan or are you eating only with a taste bud? Therefore, a lot of our clients tend to put on weight because one, fasting drops your muscle, increases the deposition of fat into your body and third, the craving to eat more sweeter and oily foods post the fasting period in the feeding phase is more than what your body actually requires and has the wrong culprits of excess sweetness and excess fats in it. So at the end of the day, my suggestion to all Muslims out there is meet a dietitian and during the Ramadan period, get a nutrition plan in place, eat with a plan, eat with a conscious choice of portions, eat with a conscious choice of protein, carbs and fats and you will live healthier during this holy period of Ramadan. So my parting line to all my Muslim brethren out there is eat with a plan, eat with a dietitian planning everything for you. My tip to you, omega-3 is one of the essential fatty acids, a gift from me to you. Include omega-3 supplement uh, in your post-fasting phase. It is the good fat, it will ensure that your cholesterol levels do not rise during the holy period of Ramadan. And inshallah, if God wills, you will come and get a diet planning at Quan Nutrition. I wish you all the best. We deliver diet plans across the world. Our Muslim dietitians will help you. And I look forward to receiving your phone call or email. God bless you.